Hi everyone, in front of me I've got Alcatel One S e Lite and let me share with you how to add the fingerprint to this device. So let's start with opening the settings and here we have to scroll in order to find security. Now let's tap on fingerprint and as you can see, this is the very first step of adding the fingerprint if you do not have the screen lock. If you've got one, you will be transferred to the proper step. If not, you really have to set it right now, because if for some reason the fingerprint sensor won't work, then you will still be able to unlock your device with the pattern pin or password. So let me pick, for example, the pattern. Let me draw it, tap on next, redraw it and confirm. Here you have to decide what kind of uh, content you want to show on the lock screen. It, it's up to you. Uh, just mark it and tap on done. And here we've got the uh, the proper section with the fingerprint. So we've got the information about the, and the fingerprint sensor. Um, so you can use it to unlock your phone, authorize the purchases or sign into apps, etc. So just tap on next. And here we have uh, the instructions. So we have to touch the sensor, which is located on the back of our device right here. So let me put my finger on it. And right now, all we have to do is to put our finger on the um, sensor multiple times in order to add our fingerprint fully and change the position of the finger to add uh, all of the edges, all of the corners, the parts of it. So it's quite easy and quick in this device. As you can see, we just successfully added the fingerprint. We can add another or simply tap on done. This is the place where we can check our fingerprint and manage it. So basically, this is the fingerprint we just added. We can tap on it and rename it or remove it just by tapping on this uh, trash bin icon. We can add another fingerprint and I'm not really sure, but I think we can add up to five different fingerprints. Here you can also uh, decide whether you want to use the fingerprint for the selfie camera shutter. Up to you if you feel that this option is um, is useful then you can turn it on just by tapping on this switcher so right now all we have to do is to check if it is working so let me lock the device and let me put my finger on the sensor and as you can see the device is unblocked which simply means that we just successfully added the fingerprint to it all right so that will be all thank you so much for watching i hope that this video was helpful and if it was please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up